What's going on gamers? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna be going over how to play better defense in Madden 23. If you enjoy these type of tips and breakdowns, make sure that you hit that red subscribe button so you do not miss any tips and tricks on the defensive side in Madden 23. Let's get right into the breakdown. Let's get it. My whole LB, boom, come out here, look for work, and we should have either the cornerback or we should have a disengage. Now, the number one key is your secondary and your lineman adjustment. So, why, why, twice? or triangle triangle brings up your secondary. That's your safety, your cornerbacks, okay? Now, another key thing that you need is if you push Y once and you go to individual, you can go to individual, push B, and then right stick down. You can individually press these people, okay? You can individually back these people up. Super easy. Y or triangle, go to individual A, and then B and down on the right stick, okay? You can do it each and every time. Now, that's a key ingredient that you need when you have somebody with a disadvantage, okay? So, if I was to set this defense up, how I would do it, I would go like this, put him on the running back, and I would blitz myself right here. Bring him into the box, okay? And what I like to do is I like to always drop down and then in the circle to play defense. I'm looking out of my peripherals at routes, okay? So, I will come down, and then I'm looking at what routes I can help out on. Okay, and then as you can see, you already have your pressure. Okay, so even if I was to do this, if I was to push R1 and press the entire team, put him on the running back and come right here and blitz myself, then I would guess pass R1 or RB and up. Now, you know that it's a certain advantage, so you can use individual and you can back him up and then you can back him up. So now they won't get beat deep as easy. Okay, so now once I come down right here, I'm gonna come look for these routes, help with any route that might get beat, and you can see I'm running right with X. He's the first one that got open, so I want to help out on that backside. Okay, so if you come right here, I'm gonna come down. That's gonna help with the offensive lineman. That's gonna confuse them. Now I'm gonna go circles. I don't wanna be strafing. I wanna come down, and then I'm looking for work. Okay, I'm looking for work. That route gets open. Everybody else is manned up accordingly. Okay, and then we got the pressure coming. As long as you have at least more than three people rushing at any given time, even if you just blitz yourself, you're gonna have that three and a half second block shed. Okay, so like I said, you can pinch your entire team, put him on the running back, blitz yourself, and then I can manually bring him off. Okay, guest pass is the key for play actions. And then I'm gonna come down and I'm gonna look for work. Who's gonna come open right here? I'm gonna help with this X, or if Y breaks open, I'm gonna run with that route right away. Okay, I always like the user across the middle a lot of people use her to D-line. You can do that on situation. But we went into a wider route. So if we went into a wider offense like this right here. Okay? So if I press the entire team, I man him up, blitz myself. Now I can individually take him off right Because Cooper Cup is a great route runner. Okay? So he's one of the uh, advantages that they would have on offense. And then I will come down, look for work. I will watch them routes right there. Cooper Cup is guarded very very good now because i gave him that little bit of time a lot of people have short and elite a lot of people have mid and elite different abilities that's something that's going to fire before 10 yards if you back him off you're going to see right here on the 50 around the 50 he's going to go five yards 10 yards and he's not going to fire he's not going to light up so that guy's able to hold him that much better if you're using man coverage. Okay, so another important thing that you can do is you can make adjustments behind the scene, but then you have to cover them spots. So if we went like this, okay, they're gonna start blocking the running back after a while. We can do this, put him into a cloud, make sure that you shade over the top. We can man him up and then blitz our user right here. You don't have to move at all. So now we have a cloud over there in case he hits the running back super fast out of the backfield and I'm shading over the top. 
okay? Because you don't want your guy to get beat. You can even back him off. Trust me, you have enough time to do all this. So boom, come down a couple steps, come back here, help with X. Now run back to this row and that cloud is over there. If he tries to throw it to the X receiver, it's gonna be locked down, okay? This is the easiest way to play defense in Madden 23, okay? So as you can see, we put that cloud over there. Now the tight end did leak out on that play, but if he was to see that guy got beat right there and he tried to throw it anyway, he'd throw it right into my cloud. If he throws it down here to this tight end who was on the delay route, it's okay, he'll pick up one or two yards. It's a game of adjustments. I'm willing to give up two to three yards instead of broken coverage and give up 30 to 40 yards. So you can do the same thing. If you pinch the team to get them that aggressive look and then manually back them off, boom, it's all set up. Now we're gonna guess pass. Now we have the same thing on that left side of the field. And then we're gonna give the guy holding Cooper Cup a little bit of advantage. So boom, if I step down to help with the block sheds, come over here and help. Now look at that. Great, great coverage. Nobody can get out of the pocket. And we got the pressure on the quarterback. A deep zone back there. Or you can put him into a deep zone like that. Okay, it's a lot of different adjustments you can do. Back him off. You can cross man him. Do this. And now you're responsible for the running back. Okay, so we're going to guess pass. You can shade over the top. Now we have another deep blue zone over there. Okay, so now look at that. Look at that B. That B that was busting open is now clamped down. And this is how you play better defense in Madden 23. You don't have to use just stock coverages. It's a lot of different things you can do to the backside. So now you have that guy who's going to be trailing that B and you manned him up. So look at this. You have a cloud over there. If they throw it quick right here, a cloud. You have him manned up over the top. You have this guy over here that you's helping, and then you have this underneath that you're willing to give up, okay? So everything on the backside is perfectly guarded. If you enjoy these type of tips and breakdown, let me know in the comment section right now. I got a lot coming and a full ebook updated once a week, offense and defense. You get one ebook, you're going to get free updates every single week for the rest of the year. Go out there and win. Yeah, baby. <laughs>